What is going on guys? We're back on another video today. We are back in our Chargers franchise. It is week five and sorry if you don't see a Desperados video today. The reason for that is because the footage corrupted and I do a pretty like strict schedule. So when something goes wrong like this, it literally drop, you know, it, it cuts me back far, sets me back far anyways. And I don't think I'm going to have time to put one up. So unfortunately, there may not be a Desperados video today. So I will make it up to you guys in the future. Let me know. Do you guys want to see a double Chargers or a double Desperados? Maybe we'll just have a double a double day one time. I don't know. It's, that'd be a lot of videos for one day, but you never know. Let me know. Would you guys, you know, if we are going to do one or the other, would you rather see two Chargers in a day or two Desperados? I would do Chicago Bears, but that one we're quite a bit ahead anyway, so I kind of want to catch up with Chargers or Desperados like I mentioned. But here we are in the Charger League, and that probably should have been picked. First throw of the game. That's a good start. It's, you know, it's always a good start when you're, you're chucking up ducks early on. Not really even a duck. But hey, he gets the ball back anyways. We fumble. I'll take it. I'd rather fumble the ball than throw a pick, I suppose, even though I kind of deserved it either way. Third and goal. Going to run up the middle, and Mariota is his quarterback. Running in for an easy score. Five minutes left in the first quarter from 27-yard line. Cleveland to the 39-yard line now. Third and second and five anyways. Four minutes in the first, taking a shot over the middle. Hunter Henry trying to catch back up into this game. Down seven. It's not looking super hot so far. Turning the ball over is rough. Slipping off. Throwing it downfield to Cleveland. I was going to go to lock it, but I just couldn't trust him because he was running away already by the time I threw it. Could have turned around. Would have been really bad. So played a little bit safe, and it still turned out well. We get popped. Fumble on the ground. Somebody pick it up, and nobody does. Recovered by the defense. That is fumble number two for Jacoby. I don't know what's going on, but it better stop. I don't even know if that's Jordan Reed. I don't think it is. I think it's somebody else. And yeah, Jordan Reed would even be that number anyways. Second and ten after the first down. Uh, nice run. Jesus runs right through us. He's still going. He's not even down yet. First and 10, start of the second quarter. We have not scored. This might be the first time in a while we haven't scored in the first quarter. And here we go. Fumble recovery by Aaron Donald at midfield. This is what we needed to do to get right back into it. Running off the wrong side, but it works out. Look at the cut move. Gaining about 15, actually 17 yards. Play action after the run. Perfect call. Look at Tyree wide open. And he gets a hit stick into the end zone. For the score, the game is all tied up. Despite uh, all the mistakes, the game is still very close. And, oh, no, diving attempt. It was worth the attempt. I mean, he almost had it. But, of course, they're going to get about 20, 30 yards on that play. Third and 15 after some good defense. This is a great chance to get off the field and maybe take the lead to the outside. That was just completely covered anyways. But it was overthrown. Maybe even saved him an interception. Who knows? First and 10, thrown across the field. Melvin Gordon going to find some room, and what a tackle by him to the 39-yard line, though. Now to the 48-yard line after a couple of short runs. Here goes Tyree Cleveland. He gets a lot of room, fights forward to the 37-yard line. We're starting to move a little bit. Bit of a slow start, but here it is. And uh-oh, Tyrell Williams, the man down the field, scores a touchdown. We are up by seven. This is a little bit more like it. The Chargers way, and there goes Bosa with another sack. Sack number two could be like 13 on the season already. It's it's ridiculous the season he's having. Third and 22, what a find. However, that's going to be a yard short, and he will not go for it. He will punt it to the outside. Tyrell Williams, unfortunate timing. There we go up for the jumper. We catch it, come down cleanly, and Tyrell scores again. Now it's 21 to 7. What a crazy one. Crazy turn of events. Two minutes, and oh no. This is not looking good for the Redskins. Falling over each other. Got to get out of the end zone, and he does. Smart play to dive there. Just so close. Gets out of the one by running. Second and six now. Mariota backed up. Throws a pick. Moses coming away with a pick. I love it. That's the guy I want with the most picks on the season. And he very well be could be very close to that. And here goes Jacoby in third and six getting sacked by Chris Jones. 24 to seven now, a minute 17 in the second quarter. 27 yard line, probably the last drive for the Redskins. And Casey Hayward jumps the pick 
and gets up. Only gets a few more yards. Casey Hayward shown he's not that old. He's still got a little bit of talent. Uh, there goes Kajuste, the second tight end on the roster. Second string, anyways. Here goes Bo Scarborough getting a carry. He almost never gets the ball. Running through a guy, gets about 11. A minute left in the second. Second and eight, a little in motion. Could that be where we go? It is Tyrell. It's going to be a flag. Oh, he's not even done. It's going to be a flag, though. And it would have been a touchdown instead. It's third and 18 from the 23-yard line, looking to run the ball with Melvin Gordon, who's got a shot, and he actually almost scores. That's crazy. Of course, one final play, field goal for the 20-point lead. Start of the second half, it is our ball, and we were about to unleash one to lock it. That would have been a tough throw, but if he would have hit that, that would have been the longest throw I've ever seen. Here, right as we're about to get hit, throws the Tyler Lockett, and it's a perfect catch. Perfect ball under pressure. Just Chargers things. What else do you want? That's It's just something you're going to see when you're watching the Chargers play. Melvin Gordon. Ooh, nice user by him. Melvin would have been gone on that left side. Melvin's having a pretty good game, too. Curl route. Good recovery by Tyree Cleveland for the first down. Second and 10. Looking for somebody open. Taking Tyrell Williams. Going all the way outside. Getting almost the first down. Or will it be a first down? It's going to be third and inches. 17-yard line. Looking for someone open. It's Hunter Henry down to the six-yard line. The best tight end in football. First and goal from the 11-yard line. Back of the end zone. Tyree Cleveland puts the dagger in. And, of course, there's no one that can remove that. Moses with the interception. Of course, the turnaround stupidity. I don't know why that's not fixed yet. We're going to run the ball. Didn't notice the score, I think. Yeah, I think we were supposed to bench our starters. And I didn't notice. I was like, oh, crap. And I dove as soon as I saw that. Of course, we bench all the guys now. Here comes Cleveland on the run, though, from the one-yard line. And he will score. So it is what it is. There's the score. 41-7. to seven. He's not going to get the throw over the middle. Fourth and eight now from the 27-yard line. Mariota looking for the first down. Can he get it? Takes a shot into double. And that is perfect coverage. There's no chance he's going to get that. Third and seven now, Eckler on the left side with, I believe, a counter. What can he do with this thing? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. We get a field goal, so now it's 44-7. to seven. Over the middle, tight end gets to the 40-yard line. But about the last play of the third quarter, third and nine. Here it is. It's going to be a pass. Trying to make something happen before the game ends. Ooh, almost a fumble opportunity. Was that Joey Bosa in coverage, basically? I think I might have pulled him off. For the five, start of the fourth. Potentially their last drive and almost picked off by Aaron Donald. Second and 11, Eckler going to fumble, but we're going to recover it. So we actually gained a couple of yards on it. Third and five, trying to convert. And here, I did not think he was going to come up with it. Bortles to Deshaun Jackson. I don't care about either of their stats. So it just makes me look like a douche. That's all I can really say about it. Donald now. I care about his stats, not going to lie. But, yeah, Deshaun Jackson, Bortles, couldn't care less. Couldn't care less. But, like I said, it just looks bad. 51-7, obviously, we're not going to score again. Probably the highest. Actually, I I can pretty much guarantee. Ooh, what a bad throw by Mariota. Pretty much guarantee that's going to be the highest score we're going to have all season. Not even a question about it. We'll never come closer. Not even close, actually. Eckler gets nothing. Just showing whatever's left of the game. I don't really think there's going to be much, really, to to look at here. Except for Moses getting pick number three. In fairness, that's pretty nice. I love me some Moses action. And it was a great play. And wow, Derwin could be the luckiest player ever. Two picks that probably shouldn't have been deserved. Got him anyways. So five interceptions, I think. No, maybe six actually. And then, of course, a lot of sacks. Offense was insane. Just an absolutely great performance. Look at Derwin. That was a, a nice jump read. On a wide open ball to him. There no real pressure there. And like I said, sorry about the Desperados video. I really, it was, it's such an important video. And it was a great one. Really good one. I'm hoping I can try to fix it. Highly doubt I will be able to. But yeah, it's probably going to only be one video today. Going to try to make it up to you guys soon. So let me know in the comment section once again. Do you want a, an extra Desperados video? Maybe Tuesday? Or do you want an extra Chargers video Tuesday? Let me know. 
But let's just say we traded for a new fella. That's all I'm going to say. Traded for a new player. And uh, that's, all, that's all I'm going to say about it. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys come back for next video. But until next video...